Hey, welcome to this video about the sound spot. I will try in a couple of minutes to give you a wide overview of what it's doing. So the sound spot is basically a very efficient tool to localize the highest sound source in an environment. So you see here, we are basically measuring now background noise, but if I start the, the car here, this, the noise will be directly located on the on the electric motor there. Okay, so it's clearly showing the higher spot. Okay, as soon as I stop, we have we will be in the background noise again. Okay, that's quite obvious here. So uh, what you can do, you have a number of features like you can uh, take a picture of the where the noise is located. We can take a video of how the it's changing as a function of time. You can store the data to be exported in the post processing software. There is also a sound level meter feature here where, you, where you, I can actually measure the dBA or the dB uh, non-weighted uh, value. There is an auto distance feature because um, the technology that we are using here needs the distance. So you can either measure it automatically or in input it uh, manually. There is an impulse noise mode or, or usual noise uh, modes. Okay, so you can um, yeah, choose that. There is also a, fee, a threshold feature. It will only trigger the, the localization if the value is above a certain uh, dB level. Then we have a scanning mode uh, feature, which, which with, uh, you can scan uh, a source and you will get uh, a number of features from that, from that particular scanning. Then finally, we also have a, a feature that allows you to filter the noise uh, by octave band. So for example, if I select here the lowest one, you see that it's not uh, necessarily locating the source because that's not, this source is not in that, in that uh, band. If I go to the four kilohertz one, it will spot easy, easily the, the loudest point. Okay, so if I, I stop it, I just want to show you globally the instrument. You see it's a, it's a portable unit, it's very light. Here on the back side, we have, uh, we can see the sensor, there are eight of them, and the, the high technology that we are using makes it uh, largely sufficient for, the, for this method. We can also see a number of sensors for the camera and also for the distance measure. Okay, it's a very light product and it's, it's a, it works very well uh, in uh, any kind of environment. So, yeah, I hope it gave you a, a nice idea of the product and uh, thank you for attending.